ATS-8000 series function arbitrary waveform signal generator PC software instruction video. JDS-8000 PC software installation. First of all, we can find the JDS-8000 series PC software installation package download link in the quick guide and the user's manual http colon double slash 68.168 132.244 jds 8000 setup underline n zip copy the link into the browser and you can download it directly after downloading Unzip the installation package. Click to install the application. Click Next, Install Finish to complete the installation. Right-click Computer Properties Device Manager Observe the serial port assigned by the computer. COM3 is the port of the JDS-8000 series signal generator. Double-click to open the installed JDS-8000 PC software. Select the COM3 port to connect. When the machine model and serial number are displayed, it means the connection is successful. General introduction of JDS-8000 PC software. Open the PC software. Select the port to connect. There are three main interfaces. Instrument control. Arbitrary waveform. Built-in waveform. First look at the instrument control interface. In the main interface of CH1 channel. You can set parameters, frequency, amplitude, offset, duty cycle, phase CH1 channel adjustment item, read current value, instrument storage clear function, CH1 channel waveform selection, CH2 channel waveform selection, Signal Output Master Switch Channel 1 Signal Output Switch Channel 2 Signal Output Switch System Setting Measurement Function CH2 Channel Adjustment Items Dual Channel Waveform Demonstration of JDS-8000 PC Software In the System Settings We enable Frequency Synchronization Waveform Synchronization Amplitude Synchronization Offset Synchronization and Duty Cycle Synchronization After the Synchronization is enabled The parameters of the CH2 channel are consistent with the parameters of the CH1 channel and the waveform of the CH1 channel can be switched. You can see that the waveform of the CH2 channel is also switched synchronously. Turn off the sync button. You can see that the CH2 channel waveform can be output independently. When the synchronization is not set, the two channels are completely independent and output with equal performance. The two channels can output the same or different signals. General parameter setting of JDS-8000 PC software. 
To set the parameters of the frequency, you can directly input the value with the keyboard. Or you can slide the mouse wheel to set the parameters of the frequency. Observe the waveform. Click the unit option on the right side of the frequency. You can select the unit of the frequency, HZ, kilohertz, MHZ, MHZ, OS. Select the unit of frequency as kilohertz. To set the parameters of the amplitude, you can directly input the value with the keyboard. Or you can click the up and down keys on the right side of the amplitude to adjust the value. Change the amplitude parameter and observe the waveform. When the JDS-8000 series signal generator is within 1 MHz, the maximum amplitude can reach 25 peak-to-peak -peak values. Change the magnitude of the amplitude by rotating the knob. Set the step value to 1 volt. And turn the knob to change the amplitude. Observe the changes in the waveform. Set the parameters of the offset. Adjust the offset value. And observe the change of the waveform. The offset range is from minus 9.99 to 12V. Switch to the pulse waveform. Adjust the duty cycle by rotating the knob. And observe the change of the waveform. The maximum duty cycle is 99.99% and the minimum is 0.01%. Switch to sine waveform. Set the parameters of the phase. Adjust the value of the phase. And observe the change of the waveform. Phase can be adjusted from 0 degree to 359.9 degrees. Modulation function demonstration of JDS-8000 PC software. Enter the instrument control interface. Switch to the amplitude modulation function and adjust the modulation frequency. See the waveform change of the modulated waveform by changing the modulation frequency. The modulation depth ranges from 0% to 200%. By changing the modulation depth of the modulated waveform, the waveform change of the modulated wave can be seen. The modulation waveform can be selected from sine waveform, square waveform, triangle waveform, rising sawtooth waveform, falling sawtooth waveform and arbitrary waveform. The default is a sine waveform. The signal source can choose internal or external modulation source. Switch to the FM function. See the FM waveform and adjust the modulation frequency and frequency deviation. See the waveform change of the modulated wave by changing the modulation frequency and frequency deviation. The modulation waveform can be selected from sine waveform, square waveform, triangle waveform, rising sawtooth waveform, falling sawtooth waveform and arbitrary waveform. The default is a sine waveform. The signal source can choose internal or external modulation source. Switch to the phase modulation function. See the waveform of the phase modulation. And adjust the modulation frequency and phase deviation. See the waveform change of the modulated waveform by changing the modulation frequency and phase deviation. The phase deviation ranges from 0 degree to 359.9 degrees. The modulation waveform can be selected from sine waveform, square waveform, triangle waveform, rising sawtooth waveform, falling sawtooth waveform and arbitrary waveform. The default is a sine waveform. The signal source can choose internal or external modulation source. Switch to the ask function. See the waveform of ask. And adjust the rate, carrier frequency and depth. See the waveform change of the modulated waveform by changing the rate, carrier frequency and depth.
ASK depth ranges from 0% to 200%. The polarity can be selected as positive and negative polarity. And the signal source can be selected as internal or external modulation source. Switch to the FSK function. See the waveform of FSK. Adjust the carrier frequency. Speed and frequency hopping. Through the carrier frequency. Speed and frequency hopping. See the waveform changes of the modulated waveform. The polarity can be selected as positive and negative polarity. And the signal source can be selected as internal or external modulation source. Switch to the PSK function. See the waveform of the PSK. And adjust the carrier frequency. Speed and phase deviation. You can see the waveform change of the modulated waveform by changing the carrier frequency. Speed and phase deviation. The PSK phase range is from 0 degree to 359.9 degrees. By changing the PSK phase, the waveform changes can be clearly observed. The polarity can be selected as positive and negative polarity. And the signal source can be selected as internal or external modulation source. Pulse burst function demonstration of JDS 8000 PC software. Switch to the pulse function. The pulse width is 0.01 microseconds to 40 seconds. The pulse period is 0.001 microseconds to 4 seconds. Change the pulse width and pulse period. And observe the waveform changes. In the pulse function, set the wave inversion. Choose normal and inversion. And observe the change of the waveform. Burst switch to the burst function. Under the burst function, the number of pulses ranges from 1 to 1, 0, 4, 8, 5, 7, 5. Set the number of pulses to 5. And press the trigger button to observe the waveform. Idle can be set to 0. Positive maximum and negative maximum. See the waveform changes in three idle modes through the oscilloscope. The trigger source can be selected from key trigger internal trigger external ac trigger and external dc trigger and key burst is selected sweep function demonstration of jds 8000 pc software sweep frequency switch to the frequency sweep function and both channels can realize the frequency sweep function the start frequency and stop frequency are the upper and lower frequency limits of the sweep frequency the frequency unit of the main interface is the same as that of the voltage control frequency. Sweep times range from 0.01 seconds to 640 seconds. After setting the start frequency, the stop frequency and sweep time. Click the start button. The instrument starts sweeping. And observe the change of the waveform frequency. The sweep direction can be selected from three directions increasing, round trip, and decreasing. Sweep mode can be chosen between linear and logarithmic modes. Press the off button and the sweep is over. Sweep amplitude. Switch to the sweep function. Set the start amplitude, the stop amplitude and sweep time. The instrument starts sweeping. And observe the change of the waveform frequency. The sweep direction can be selected from three directions increasing, round trip, and decreasing. Sweep mode can choose between linear and logarithmic modes. Press the off button to end the sweep. And the waveform is switched to pulse waveform. Sweep duty cycle. Switch to the sweep duty cycle function. 
Now set the start duty cycle and the stop duty cycle. Press the on button. The instrument starts to sweep the duty cycle. And then set the sweep time. And the sweep direction increases. There are three scanning modes in descending and round trip mode. Adjust them in turn. See the change of the duty cycle of the waveform. The sweep mode has two modes logarithmic and linear. Switch the mode to see the change of the waveform. By pressing the off button to end the sweep duty cycle. Voltage control function demonstration of JDS 8000 PC software. Next, introduce the voltage control function of the external input signal. First, use the CH1 channel of the JDS-2800 arbitrary or function signal generator to output a DC level signal. And connect the CH1 interface of the JDS-2800 and the MOD interface of the JDS-8000 through the BNC cable. Switch to the voltage control frequency function. The frequency unit of the main interface is the same as that of the voltage control frequency. And the start frequency and the stop frequency can be set within the frequency range. After setting, perform voltage calibration. You can set the maximum voltage and minimum voltage within 0 to 5V. Set the offset of the DC level to 1V, and click the yellow arrow pointing to the minimum value for a minimum voltage calibration. And when the DC level is set to 5V, click the yellow arrow pointing to the maximum value for a maximum voltage calibration. Press the on button to start the voltage control. Adjust the offset of the DC level. And see the change of the waveform frequency. The sweep mode has two modes logarithmic and linear. By pressing the OFF button to end the voltage controlled frequency. Switch to the voltage control amplitude function. Start to set the start amplitude and the stop amplitude. Click the start button to start the voltage control. Observe the change of the waveform. The sweep mode can be switched to linear and logarithmic. Adjust the offset of the DC level. See to the change in waveform amplitude. Switch to the voltage control duty cycle function. Adjust the offset of the DC level. Observe the change of the waveform. Set the duty cycle of the starting point and the stop point. And see the change of the waveform. Measurement function demonstration of JDS 8000 PC software. Connect the XT interface of the instrument to the DC level signal output interface through a BNC cable. Find the measurement mode on the instrument control interface. Click the on button. And the instrument starts to measure. The coupling method can be switched to alternating current, AC or direct current DC. The measurement mode can be switched to low, frequency is less than 2 kHz or high frequency is more than 2 kHz. The gate time range is 0.001 second to 10 seconds. And the default is 1 second. The measurement frequency. Period, positive pulse width. Negative pulse width and duty cycle of the input signal can be measured. Arbitrary Waveform Editing Demonstration of JDS-8000 PC Software First generate a sine waveform Generate waveform button Clear waveform button Amplitude and offset button Select a sine waveform Adjust the value of amplitude and offset Click the amplitude and offset button See the change of the waveform points click the button to adjust the points
See the changes of the points on the horizontal axis of the waveform. Look at the magnifying glass on the right again. Click the magnifying glass. Adjust the waveform up and down. Zoom in and out. Look at the vertical mirror and the horizontal mirror again. Observe the changes in the waveform. Phase input a value. Click the adjust phase button and observe the change of the waveform. Switch to pulse waveform. Generate waveform. Adjust amplitude and number of points. Copy all waveforms to arbitrary waveform A. Add 22 waveforms here. Select DC. Generate waveform. And add it to arbitrary waveform A. You can see the new waveform is generated. Copy the waveform of arbitrary waveform A to the main interface. Name the waveform 22 plus 1. Click to name and save the waveform. And directly store it in the 101 position of the machine. Read the button. We will read the 22 plus 1 waveform just drawn. Click the read waveform to read it out. Clear the waveform. Switch to sign waveform. Adjust the amplitude and number of points. Copy all of them to arbitrary waveform, A. Adjust the amplitude and number of points. And add it to arbitrary waveform, A. You can choose the adjustment amplitude according to your desired waveform. The value set here is gradually increased. Then gradually decreased. Add it to the arbitrary waveform, A in turn. Name the waveform SIN01. Click to name and save the waveform. And directly store it in the 102 position of the machine. Save the file and choose where you want to save it. Take a look at the file we just saved. These numbers represent the number of points in the waveform on coordinates. Open the file. Clear the waveform before opening. Here we open the file just stored. And you can see the waveform we just edited. To clear these waveforms, we select Assign Pulse Waveform. Adjust the amplitude and number of points and copy them all to arbitrary waveform, A. Select the Lorentz waveform. Adjust the amplitude and number of points. Click the part to copy it to the arbitrary waveform B, and click a plus B, a minus B, and a multiply B in turn to calculate different waveforms. Switch the waveform to a polyline. Set the parameters for the start and stop points. Click to generate a waveform. Copy all of them to arbitrary wave A. Change the parameters and add them to arbitrary wave A. You can see the changes in the waveform. Arbitrary waveforms on the main interface can be customized. You can edit the desired waveforms and store them in the JDS-8000 instrument. Built-in waveforms of JDS-8000 PC software. First click Common. You can see some commonly used waveforms. Engineering waveforms. Filter waveforms. Signal waveforms. Modulation waveforms. Bioelectrical waveforms. Medical electronic waveforms.
Automotive Electronic Waveforms Mathematical Waveforms Distribution Function Waveforms Trigonometric Function Waveforms Inverse Trigonometric Function Waveforms Window Function Waveforms Next, take a look at the waveform storage. You can store the waveform in the positions 22 to 39 according to your needs. Click the desired waveform. Click Save. And the storage is successful. PC Software Firmware Update Method First, we open the JDS 8000 PC Software. Select the port. Click the link. You can see the version check button in the lower right corner. Click it. It will open the website directly in your browser. The first row is the latest firmware version number. Click the back URL. The download interface will pop up. Select the storage location. Here is the desktop. Now turn off the JDS 8000 instrument. First press and hold the first button 1 of the function software. Then press and hold the power button 2 to power on. After entering the firmware update interface. Open the firmware update software. Click open file above to select the downloaded file. Then select the port. Click open port. After the port is selected successfully. Off will become on. Click run to upgrade. And you can see the progress of the upgrade. After completion, click exit to close the software. Restart the JDS 8000 instrument and the firmware upgrade is complete. Thank you for watching.